Hi, it's Rich Tarani with TMCNet. Thanks for watching. We are in uh, Silicon Valley this week, Santa Clara to be exact, with a uh, TMCNet Editor's Day uh, roadshow. We, we go around the country just talking to some of the best and uh, brightest companies out there. And uh, Parker Truen is with us, and he's with uh, Aria. Welcome to the show. Great to be here. Thank you. So you've been on the show before, but in case someone hasn't had a chance to... Uh, see that video or they're not as familiar. Tell us a little bit about your company, what you guys do. Well, um, Aria is a cloud-based billing and monetization uh, provider that uh, uniquely helps uh, global enterprises uh, maximize their uh, usage-based and subscription revenues so that they can take advantage of every revenue moment and obviously uh, grow their profits. So. Uh, Give us some examples, please, of how you're, you're helping your customers. Yeah, sure. Um, one, of the, one of the best examples I can think of is uh, Pitney Bowes, a company that's been around for 96 years. And uh, we all know of them as uh, providing mail meters and really a hard products company. And they are transforming their business uh, into a digital services company. Uh, and they have just launched this year uh, a product called the Commerce Cloud, which is taking all their products and uh, turning them into services. And what we do is help enable them by complementing their uh, existing ERP system, allowing them to not have to code uh, products, prices, and plans, but simply configure that so that they can get products to market more quickly and uh, better meet uh, customer demands. In addition to that, uh, they can offer usage-based services, which um, get very, very complicated uh, when you think about that, um, not only on the individual level of what do I want to buy and how much am I buying, but when you think about where people are buying and uh, whether it's in what ge geography, uh, what's tax system they have to uh, uh, account for, uh, what currency they're in. And we help um, automate some of that and make it very, very efficient for them. So like you said, large companies that have complex billing and um, complex order management and just kind of integrating with ERP, allowing them to more simply get paid for the services that they deliver without focusing on being a collections company. Yeah, I mean, the, the challenge that I would say is you've got very large businesses who invested millions of dollars in legacy systems that have been around since the last century. And what's happened since the last century is business has changed. Uh, we've moved from a 24-month development cycle to a development cycle of six to eight weeks. And unfortunately, the IT systems and the processes around them and, and the technology around them hasn't kept pace. And so they have systems that uh, require an 18 to 20 more, uh, four month development cycle. And so you're, you've got a mismatch where product marketing and product management wants to get uh, products out very, very quickly and they are being uh, roadblocked by their billing systems. And, and that's uh, really impacting their ability not only to serve customers, but to be competitive. So I imagine as more companies are going to an as-a-service model, you're positioned well to help them. Well, we, we obviously think so. And we obviously think there's a great business opportunity around that. Um, not only are, are companies going to an as-a-service model, but they're looking for the widest possible way of offering those products and services to their customers. So we've, we've moved from the Henry Ford model of uh, you can have any uh, car you want as long as it's black to uh, customers demanding a wide variety of cust uh, custom colors, options, does it come with uh, cruise control or not, and moving beyond that, not only how they want to buy that uh, ownership. So we've got uh, Audi On Demand, um, which um, offers companies 
or offers uh, uh, customers rather the opportunity to purchase on a per use occasion uh, uh, an Audi experience. So they get a high quality luxury brand whenever they want it. And what we do is uh, provide the back end billing uh, uh, for that so that they get a very easy to read bill immediately after they've used the car. And so we've moved from cars, as, as you know, um, that have a two year development cycle to people wanting the latest car in an instance. And we help facilitate that process so that every, both the customer and the company uh, gets the best experience possible. That's great. So uh, what's next? Well, uh, what's next is I, th I think what, we're, what we've already talked about is going to be accelerating. We're going to see an increase in uh, an acceleration of go-to-market times. We're going to see an increased focus on the customer. Um, and we're here to help. And um, what, what companies will be looking for and what companies will be judged on ultimately is do I get the product I want in a timely fashion and am I accurately billed for that service uh, in a bill that I can understand? And too often the, the case is uh, that's a mismatch. If you've, uh, if you've used your internet service provider, often you'll, you'll find the bill is not that easy to understand. And, uh, you'll find that there are some often inaccuracies on that. And that's why you find that CSPs have a, a, um, a, a very low net promoter score. So Communication we're, service yes, providers. Yes, correct. Yeah. So we're, we're here, here to help that. And in fact, what we're finding is a lot of CSPs are, are fundamentally going under a transformation themselves, moving from a communication service provider to a digital service provider. And they're looking at us, and we have, uh, we're ready to announce two very large deals in the space to help them uh, with their billing and monetization. So in that case, you have to interface with the OSS, BSS uh, platforms, which is not an easy thing. It's not. And uh, what we do is we help integrate with that uh, to make sure that that platform is all aligned with the, the billing and monetization. Fantastic. Well, thank you so much for being here. This was great. Great. Great to see you.